internet. Um, cloudy today. Wonder why. Anyway, enough of that. Um, I wasn't sure whether I was going to film this or not, but I'll film it, and if it ends up on the internet, then so be it. Um, the smart car behind me, something I've been working on lately. Um, all past the MOT, okay, everything was fine. I have noticed, though, there's a, a wheel bearing on the driver's side that's getting a little noisy. Um, so I'm going to take the wheel off, have a look at it. Um, I think they're only about 25 quid for a new one, so I'm uh, just going to have a look. Um, see if there's anything obvious, maybe some dirt of ingress in there, don't know. But if it's not, end up replacing it. So um, join me, why don't you? <laughs> Could be fun, who knows. So she's up in the air, bit of a spin. Yeah, the thing that gets me straight away, we've got a little bit of uh, noise from the pads, but... Yeah, that sounds like bearing. Let's get the wheel off. So the wheel's off. First job, top bolt there. Undo that one. That is a, a 13 mil. Good old 13 mil. Right, so that one's out. That should then enable me to peel the caliper back. Like so. It's quite an interesting idea, this. Pull out the pads. Which uh, got plenty of meat. Yeah, you can hear it now. Yeah, that, that's a that's a wheel bearing that's gone, without doubt. Right, we need to get the holder off and then um, get the disc off. Right, an interesting design on the holder. Let me try and get you around here, because there is a star drive, as I call them, but that's probably not the official term. Star drive, right in there. Yeah, interesting arrangement. Um, yeah, stuck right in there. Similar to um, those up there. So let's get it out. Right, so there you go, good old socket set, and it would seem it would be a E14. Let's get it in there. Uh, they're kind of doing this blind a bit. Um, okay, different size to those, so it's not a 14. Let's try a 16. Again, not easy to get into. Okay, so 16. Can't be an 18, surely. Um, okay, it could be. <laughs> yeah, E18 looks like the one. Hmm, it's a big one. There you go, it's so the one at the top I've shown you already. And then one, let's try and get you around there. One tucked down there as well. There you go, it's a caliper and holder off. And uh, tucked away nicely back there, so we're not straining any pipes. Let's make it a little bit more secure. There you go. Right, cap off now. Um, actually, nope, disc off first. And uh, yeah, then we'll get down to the wheel bearing. Just noisy. There you go. One screw out. Pretty new stuff, this. Um, this at the front are quite new. Um, what size is that? I have no idea. T25. There you go. T25 in there. And then this comes off. Simple as. Right, what have we got here then? So we've got the ABS ring and a very, very noisy bearing. Right, cap off and then bolt out. Now that is a stretch bolt, um, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to be changing this anyway. Yeah, and if not, I'll just get a new stretch bolt. There you go, a little bit of tappy tappy and it comes out. But uh, not tappy tappy. <laughs> Does some more damage. Right, that's there. It's another one of these crazy E things, which this time is an E16. Let's do it. There you go, E16 straight out. Um, now that should just pull out, um, but I'm going to need two hands. There you go, it's off. Yeah, not much to say about it really. Well, to be honest, looking at it and just having to mess about with it, the bearings look good. Um, everything looks good, but it was a bit dry. I'm kind of wondering if I can get away with just greasing it. I might have on the back end bearings in the carriage. I'm going to have a play with this. So, took it off. Uh, I know somebody's used copper grease before in there, which is not the grease to use. So I put some lithium stuff in there. But, as you can hear, I thought the bearings all seem okay. Um... It ain't okay, so it's a new one.
But I've got a new one ordered, uh, but it's not going to be here till next week. So um, this one ain't going to get any worse. It's got plenty of grease in there now um, and the right grease as well. Um, but I'm not using the car that much, um, so it doesn't really matter too much. But anyway, that's how you get to it and that's how you take it off. Putting it back together, pretty much roll reversal to be honest. So uh, I know it's been a short video, but they're sometimes the best ones. Right, that'll do for now. Bye bye everybody. As a special treat, she's going to get treated to some poor too. <laughs> <laughs>